Hi guys, it's LJ here. Um, sorry for the lack of light. It is an awful day here and I'm kind of... I walked around the house trying to find the best natural light. This is it. Um, it is also very dark so I have got lights on as well. Um, unfortunately it is just such a horrible day today that the lighting isn't great so I do apologise. But I hope you can still see everything. So. What I've got for you today, I've been making, as you saw from when I made the little embellishments, the decoupage pieces, I'm making some photo albums for family members. So I've got these two, which are the first two that I made, um, and I learned a lot making them, which is also a really important part of crafting, I think. Um, but I was very aware that the people I'm making these for are not crafters. They, um, they won't have the tools and the capacity, sorry, I just need to drink. to crop photos, to do all of that bits and pieces. So I've tried where possible to keep to a standard size. I went on to a couple of the online photo printing places um, and got some average sized photos from the, both of those and tried to do those to fit it in. Um, so let me show you. This is the first one that I made, which is for a baby girl. So this is our cover. I've got a nice little wooden piece that I just rubbed my ink over. And this is one of the little decoupage pieces that I made. Got a little It's a Girl ribbon, this gorgeous little rocking horse on the spine. And then the back is very plain with just the baby girl's name. Gorgeous. Is that not a gorgeous name? That is absolutely a gorgeous name. I love Irish names. I love that I'm marrying into a family with Irish names. They're just gorgeous. So I'll go through it with you and show you bits and pieces. So... On the front page, I was thinking here could be like um, ultrasound or a baby bump photo on there. And then you open it up. I've got a little envelope that you could put the bracelet, hospital bracelet in or anything like that that you want to keep. And I've got the side here for the little photo which says new arrival. And then I've got this little pocket with two photo mats in slightly different colours of pink she said she did definitely want pink I did check whether she wanted a more neutral colour tone but she said no she'll have pink um, and then I've used these stickers throughout but I wanted to not do too many and then I've given her these stickers so when she then adds the photo she can put a sticker on or next to it or whatever so just to make life a little bit easier for her because obviously I said she's not a crafter so that's page this front cover that's got a magnet on so what i've tried to do is do sort of like a page per month for the first year so this is the first month and it is actually open at the top at the side so you can put a photo in and there's that's underneath and then you've got a little photo here that says bundle of joy a little photo here a little sticker here that says bundle of joy and then you open this out and you open this out for first month photos there is I'll put out on this one so second month same thing I've got this little um, clothespin that is open two months is open on the side so you can put a photo in there this one lifts up and down and you've got something here that says sweet baby a little sticker and then you've got your deer here and the deer is left open so you can add a photo behind it third month again <coughs> excuse me you can put it behind the um stickers <coughs> so third month opens up and then you've got just a very simple waterfall again i tried to make these sized so they don't actually have to cut the photos they should just all slot in here we've got a pullout which i've got just the darkest pink on so that goes in there. Four months, you've got this gorgeous little baby crawling, which is on left open or is not? I don't remember this one. No, this one is not. And then we open this out and you've got a nice little pocket. Again, a couple of photo mats, a couple of the tiny tags that came with the photo, with the paper pack. Those go in there. Five months. Oh, five months is not open. That was not what I planned to do. Oh, yes, it is. 
because there was so much room on five months. Now I love this one. This one I think is my favourite page and I don't know if it's going to all fit on camera, but we'll see. So you lift up. I've got this gorgeous little hat and you lift out. And then this one comes down and lifts out. So you've got all the space for so many photos. These obviously you would have to cut a photo down to put on the side pieces, but you could write on these. Neither of them are very dark. So you've got that light green there and then this baby pink. You could write on them and either write a message for the baby or just write some notes about how it's been, um, important people that have come and met the baby, any events you've been to, like Christmas time or anything like when was their first, when did they first crawl, all of these different bits and pieces. So there's lots of space to do things like that. This one then turns to six months. Six months you have the open baby grow and the open six months. This folds out to the side and to the side again. Okay, and then because we're bang in the middle for seven months, these are open. I've done the same. Opens again and then again. So you have got a huge widespread for this one. For six and seven months. Okay, eight months, you've got this gorgeous little hat and thing, and this just lifts up and down. Nine months, I love, I love this little whale. Love, come on tail, there we go. I love this little whale. And then nine months just opens to the side. And we've got a pull out here. So again, this can be photos, this can be journaling, this can be whatever you want on here. these pieces. Could be messages for the baby to read when she's older. Um, could be all sorts of things. 10 is a little gatefold with a magnet. So again, this could be used for either very small photos like the, um, the Instaprint Polaroid type ones would go on these. And you've got space for a, a larger size photo. Again, help with the magnet. 11 months is just a pocket. With some photo mats and a little tag, but you can pop a photo. No, you can pop a little photo on this one. It can go behind the star, but not behind the 11 months. Then 12 months is a lift up and lift down. And then what I've done, because obviously the first birthday is quite a big thing. I've done the back cover as the first birthday. So this is the 12th month, but this is birthday. And you can get up underneath birthday so you can put the, the corner of your photo under there and same with your cake and then this opens up so you've got a small pocket that you can tuck things into you've got some more of the little tags you can stick on things and then you've got very small four by four waterfall to add some party photos in so that is my first baby girl album I've then made a baby boy album this one's a bit different and i've been experimenting with different things so this one i've popped the name on the front isn't tin and such a lovely name as well abby and tin and they're just gorgeous so this has got some little blue feet the baby again the wood piece that i have rubbed my ink on and then i've got the it's a boy here whereas on the girl album i wrapped the paper and the ribbon on the boy album i haven't i've left it so that you can see the craft card on the spine i did add a little dangle to this and I'm thinking I'm going to go back to the baby girl and add a little dangle as well because it's so cute. So I've got, turn around, so I've got 2019 with this little heart. I've got a little blue dummy and then a silver dummy. And they hang when you stand it up perfectly, it doesn't touch the floor. So I love that. So the front is this with the name, the back is just black, uh, black, blank. Sorry, that's my cat meowing to go out. No, darling, it's raining. Sorry, you might hear a few meows now. So, on the baby boy, it's set out in a very similar way, but the pages are in a slightly different order, and I don't have the same thing. So, I've got this bun in the oven sticker for here. I might go back and put one on the girls' album, we'll see. I've got our same thing. So, this one, I've got this you can open and put behind. Same with the welcome baby. That's off camera, I still apologise. So you can go behind there and behind there. And this has got little stats because in I got a boys sticker set and it had the stats. The girls one didn't have one unfortunately, which is really frustrating. But 
There we go. Same with this, you've got your little envelope. No. To put things in, you've got your little pocket with two photo mats, which I've got. He's finally here, and congratulations. And two of the little tags that came with the set. So that again would be the baby bump photo or the ultrasound. Again, so month one. Again, all of these things open up. I backed the stickers. Um, if they're stickers, I've backed them on card and cut round them. Um, and if they're ephemera pieces, I've only just stuck past. No, darling, sorry. No, it's wet and horrible. You're not going back outside. Sorry. So, um, I've got these little blue sticks as well. I love these sparkles. So, again, very similar. Opens up the same way for a lot of them. Got our up and down. We've got our little waterfall now this one because the craft card was so much thicker than um the white card was i haven't backed this oh that's coming off huh. um oh, i stuck that one now there we go it's odd yes yeah, so i've only backed the top one i haven't backed the others partly because then Again, they'll have more frame around their photos, and partly because um, the craft card is so much thicker. I mean, this album is much wider than the other one. So, just another thing I've learned about how these are being made. So, that's three months. Again, we've got pull out with paper on both sides. It's just lots in there. I love this edge. Punched it. And then you've got four months where you've got another side pocket with photo mat and the things I love. Can I just show you this little monkey paper? I love this monkey paper. Um, so is that one? Five months. This is where it differs. Five months is your fold out that way. There isn't a matching middle set in this one. The this is the huge open out all the way there and open out all the way down here. So again, these are both very pale, so you can do some journaling or message writing on them. Um, seven months is another open. Oh no, this is a. This is not an open side. This is an accordion fold. So it does open this way, but it also opens this way. So you've got lots of room for photos. So what's that? One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six by six slots. So that will. Um, provide space for a lot of photos little pocket with two photo mats this one says so cute i did not back that sticker so that one doesn't lift up because it was an acetate sticker and then again two little tags nine months just opens to the side another pull out ten months is your up just your up with a little baby groom eleven months is down So, sorry, what's, keep pulling it towards me off camera, I'm so sorry. 11 months is your down, 12 months goes up with that monkey paper again and down. I love the little washing line as well. Um, for 12 months and then again, you've got your birthday so you can get behind the birthday, you can get behind the bear. And then this one I've done slightly different. I haven't put a pocket and I haven't put a waterfall. I thought for this one they could do... Um, just some nice large photos from it um, and be done. So they're slightly different but have a lot of similarity. So if I put them both there. So what I've used for these, I've used the... There's a baby boy and a baby girl collection from first edition, I believe. There is also some... Stop, stop! Sorry, my cat has been very noisy today. Um, this, the yellow and grey ones are um, back to basics for baby, baby steps. Sorry, I can't speak today. Back to basics, baby steps. And then what's the other set? Oh, I can't remember the other set off the top of my head. I'll link all the papers below. And the same for this one. You've got the baby girl, which is the first edition baby girl, I believe. You've got the silver 
uh, the grey and yellow, which is the Back to Basics Baby Steps, and you've got the other set, which I can't remember right now. But as I said, the craft card is so much thicker. I was worried about how thick this was. And then I've made the craft card, but once they get photos in it, it's going to be like that. So I don't know how functional it is for usage. So um, I'm hoping that they'll give me a little bit of feedback on it. But I'm making a third one at the moment and I have made some adaptions for that. So um, yeah, hopefully that'll be the same. So thank you for spending time with me today. I hope you enjoyed seeing my little albums. These are the first albums I've made. Um, so a learning curve and lots of things I've realised and lots of things I've thought oh, I should have done that so uh, hopefully my next one will be, a little, be an improvement and then improvement improvement as crafting always is so yeah thank you very much for spending time with me today any questions or comments leave them below thank you very much have a crafty day bye